Prince Harry was reportedly snubbed from being invited to dinner with King Charles and Prince William, his estranged father and brother, just hours after Queen Elizabeth died, a royal source has claimed. The Duke of Sussex flew to Aberdeen to see his grandmother after learning that the end was near, but she passed away at Balmoral before he got there, on September 8, 2022. Harry and his wife Meghan Markle happened to be at the UK anyway for a charity event, with the prince later alleging he had learned of her death through a BBC News alert on his phone. Upon his arrival at the Scottish estate, he was met by his aunt Princess Anne, who warmly embraced him before taking him to see the Queen. Harry was not reunited with Charles and William until they travelled to London the next day, with a new biography claiming the Duke was left out of a secret meeting about dealing with the fallout from the Queen's death. Stay up to date with the latest royal news join us on WhatsApp our community members are treated to special offers, promotions, and adverts from us and our partners. You can check out at any time. More info biographer Robert Hardman wrote in his book Charles III, New King. New Court, the inside story that William and the King had dinner with Queen Camilla at Burke Hall, Charles' home on the Scottish estate. He said, the King needed to have vital but discreet discussions with his elder son. In years gone by, such a moment would automatically have included his younger son, too. But not anymore, Mr. Hardman claimed Harry was left out of the discussion for fear he was taking notes for his forthcoming book, and the new king needed a clear head and no distractions. Become an Express Premium member support fearless journalism read the Daily Express online, advert free get super fast page loading start 30 day free trial it was claimed that Meghan Markle had been banned from joining her husband due to their ongoing feud with the firm. However, Princess Kate also chose to stay away and be with her children. That evening Harry dined with his aunt and cousins, including Zara Tyndall, and then had to fly commercial to get back to London quickly. He wrote in his memoir Spare, the quickest way back would have been a lift with Pa or Willie. Barring that it was British Airways, departing Balmoral at daybreak. I bought a seat and was among the first to board. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex have once again found themselves embroiled in controversy after it emerged that Queen Elizabeth may not have given them their blessing for naming their daughter Lilibet. Lilibet was the nickname used by close friends and family of the Queen, as when she was a child she struggled to say her own name Elizabeth. The couple claimed they would not have used the name if she had not been supportive but apparently Harry and Meghan's decision caused her distress in her final months.